so finally finally it's going to be done today um i've had a few minor setbacks here and there things just being difficult but finally managed to get there i've got the calipers on um same color as the car as i said as i've got the paint uh mixed from the paint shop in a spray can so yeah looking looking amazing honestly what a transformation what a difference so as usual i'm losing daylight so i need to be quick because i still need to get the exhaust on um, once i've got the exhaust on i need to run to the petrol station grab some fuel fill up the tank and obviously put the wheels on i think i'm going to put some spaces on the back purely because i've noticed that when I took the old suspension arm off, you could see on the tire and on the on the suspension as well that the tire had been rubbing. So it needs to have a spacer on there to bring the tire further away from the suspension. So I'm going to do that as well. Um, I've noticed they've got two spacers on the front. It looks like a 2.5 mil and possibly a 1.5 or 1 mil spacer. I think it's a bit too too wide at the front. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take one of the spacers off the front and put it on the back here. Um, just to bring the back tyres out a bit but yeah got my new handbrake cables on that was from ebay i think they were 27 pounds each um which was all right i've got this abs sensor coming from this side because it's damaged from where i removed it from the old arm but i've got some new splash guards coming as well they're, they're coming in black so yeah so nearly there nearly there I've also adjusted the suspension on the BC coilovers, so I've got it sitting a little bit higher because I don't like how the previous owner had it. He had it very low. I'm talking low that every bump you have to um, go extremely slowly. Um, and when you go over, when you're driving a bit fast and the road's a bit bumpy, you, as soon as it bounces, you can hear the tires rubbing up against the arches. Um, the front driver side arch is completely demolished on the inside completely worn out from the tire rubbing against it so i will make adjustments to the front um, at a later date but for now i just want to get the exhaust on get the car running take it for a test drive make sure there's no noises or knocking from the back end and then happy days so yeah so um yeah i shall upload another video once it's up and running and go on a little test drive so i'll catch you guys later